Hello everyone, this is the instructional video on how to save multiple PDF pages into one PDF using DocHub. The documents that I am going to use today are these scanned pages that were submitted to me. We're going to go to the, the PDF page that we want to be number one in our merged PDF. I'm going to go to that first page file and I'm going to right click on it, open with, and I'm going to choose DocHub. Just as before, the document will open in the program. To add another page into the document to merge them together, we are going to go over into our menu file over here and say File, go to Actions, hover over it so that you get this second menu, go down to Appended, Append Pages, again hover over it to get this third menu, and then you are going to choose Merge and Append File. The file I am using, using happens to be on Google Drive. The next page that you need may be on your computer. Either way, you are going to choose where that document is saved and navigate to it in either drive. So I'm going to go to my Google Drive where my saved page is and I'm going to navigate to that page. Now my page just happens to be right in my Google Drive folder, my main folder. So instead of scrolling for it, I'm just gonna search for it. And I'm going to choose what page I want to be next in my merged document. So I want this Scan 19 to be next. I will click on it once, choose Select, and you'll see that it has grabbed the document that you want to append. You are only able to do one page at a time. Okay. So when you're ready, you're going to choose the green append button. And you'll see it says the file successfully appended to the document. So if you scroll down, you'll see it says it shows you now have two pages in one file. <clears throat> If you need to add more pages, you would just continue the process in the same order that we just did the last one. When you are all finished and you are ready to save your document, you are going to go to File, Download, Export, and again, you can save it to wherever you are most comfortable with. You can save it to your computer, or if you are able, you can save it straight to your Google Drive. It's going to create a new copy. You can choose which folder you want to save it to. All right. I don't know why. I always have problems with that. Okay, it never lets me search like this. Um, so in this case, I'm going to save it to Math 8, Homework Submissions. Let's say it was homework for period one, I would put it in there. And again, you can't go all the way into the folder, just highlight the folder that you want it to go to because if you go into the folder, you'll see you lose the ability to select. So you get to the folder and you just highlight it. Do not go into the folder. Right. So period one homework is where I'm going to save this. Once I've highlighted the folder I am saving it to, I will click select. And then I will name my file, last name, first name, and then I can choose export. All right, it is now saved to my Google Drive and I can ask it to show it to me. So once I click show it to me, it'll take me to my Google Drive. It'll take me to the folder that I saved it in. And you will be able to see here is my PDF. It successfully saved it. And it always opens in Lumen. I have that set as my default program. And you can see that I, can, I am able to now access your homework in the homework submission folder. And I can go through and I can check it. 